Hello guys and welcome back to another episode and uh, recently the fishing has been a little bit tough so as you know by the title of this video I'm going to be doing a uh, mystery tackle box unboxing for the month of January. Uh, it is February right now I'm a little bit delayed on my videos but I do have some bangers coming up so you guys stay tuned subscribe and smash that like button. We are almost at 50 views for my most popular video, the $15 Walmart Fishing Challenge. So thank you guys for all the support. We're almost at 25 subscribers, which is unbelievable to me. Because really, this channel is just something that I wanted to do for fun. And it's kind of crazy to think about that people actually watch this stuff. So thank you guys for all the support. And uh, I'm going to stop talking. We'll get right into this Mystery Tackle Box unboxing. And then I'm going to organize my fishing stuff and give you guys a little bit of a look at my whole collection. So I'm going to stop talking and let's head right into it. So here it is, guys. This month's Mystery Tackle Box. This is the Mystery Tackle Box for the month of January. And uh, yeah, let's get right into this unboxing. So guys, the first bait in this box is this little Savage Gear Lures with an Attitude 3D Bluegill Swim Bait right here. And uh, it's a nice dark bluegill pattern. And uh, this should definitely catch some big fish. It's a big bait and it looks like a pretty good swim bait and uh, hopefully it has some nice action in the water. And the next thing in our box is this little Ketchco sticker right here. It looks like a guy riding a little square bill crankbait. So I'm definitely gonna put this on my tackle box along with the mystery tackle box sticker that I already have on there. I uh, have gone ahead and I actually took the sticker that was in this mystery tackle box and actually slapped it onto my tackle box along with this other sticker from my first ever mystery tackle box slam video. If you guys wanna go watch that, I will link it right up there if you guys wanna go ahead and watch that. But uh, yeah, it's a little bit of a bigger sticker, nice and smooth. Had to put it over this little bump, but uh, should be okay. And now onto the next bait. Here we have some stickies, uh, little 4 aught EWG worm hooks right here. These are gonna be really good for Texas rigs. These are gonna be really good for worms and swim baits. Perfect size 4 aughts, exactly what I like to use. And stickies actually are a really, really good brand. I highly recommend you use these. So that's definitely a good choice. And those hooks will definitely pair well with these uh, 10,000 fish saw crawls. Um, by 10,000 fish and these are really really cool these are looks like you know pretty much watermelon red flake green pumpkin ish really really cool they have a raised viewage for action just like the doing squad cracking crawls and I'm really excited to use these especially with these worm hooks you can text us with these really well and uh, these look really good so I'm excited to use that so the next bait in here is actually pretty interesting it's like this swim bait right here by uh, Lunker City and it's in pumpkin seed chartreuse tail. And there's eight of them in this bag. They're about 3.25 inches. And I um, honestly don't think I'll catch any fish on these because a lot of the ponds in my area are really clear. So the chartreuse tail might just be too much. I'm not sure, but we might be able to catch a fish on this. And then last but not least, we have these Z-Man 10 times tough little stretchy curl tails right here. This is in like a new penny color. These again, I don't think I'll be able to catch any fish with. This I might more than the other little swim bait, but um, I'll definitely try these out. It's a new type of bait and that's pretty much the whole idea of Mystery Tackle Box is to introduce you to new baits and different fishing styles. And it comes to your door every month, which is really nice. So definitely try and use these and hopefully catch a fish on it. And that is it guys, that is it for this mystery tackle box right here. So guys, I'm actually gonna organize my fishing stuff because I went over here to go put my mystery tackle box away and it is a big mess over here. I went fishing recently and just dumped all my stuff, all my fishing stuff. So I'm gonna get this quickly organized. If you guys like these vlogs and stuff, let me know down in the comment section below. And uh, yeah, let's get started. Mm -hmm. 